Russian author Leo Tolstoy and his wife Sofia Bears had one of the worst marriages in literary history. Despite the couple's initial attraction and Sofia's invaluable assistance to his work, their marriage was far from serene. Things got off to a rocky start when he forced her to read his diaries, chock full of his premarital sexual exploits, even the night before their wedding. As Tolstoy's interest in spiritual matter grew, his interest in his family went, leaving Sofia to shoulder the burden of running their ever-increasing business and navigating Tolstoy's ever-fluctuating mood. By 1880s, with Tolstoy's disciples living on the family estate and the author cobbling his own shoes and wearing peasants' clothing, an increasingly angry Sofia demanded him to sign over the control of his publishing royalties, lest he might bankrupt his family. By 1910, the deeply unhappy 82-year-old author had seen enough and fled from his home in the middle of one night. His disappearance caused a media sensation. After a few days, he was found at a railway station followed by a huge crowd media and his wife arriving there, but he refused to return home. On November 20, 1910, he passed away from pneumonia.